Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another video uh, wherein I make art of some sort. Um, it is summertime in Central Texas. I know this because I have to get up by at the latest 10 a.m. if I want to go outside and, like, not melt. So, uh, welcome to summertime. It's officially time of the summer. Summertime. Uh, anyway, uh, it's been on and off for me, um, wanting to make art or, like, feel comfortable or enjoyment from making art recently. Um, I think that just has to do with the state of the world and this, like, I don't know, pressing need to be productive during this time while we're all trying to stay at home and stay safe and all of that. Uh, but I've just been going through waves of enjoying drawing things, uh, and just feeling, like, creatively lethargic, I guess, is a good way of putting it. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Some days I just want to sit and play video games, or I'll go through spurts of just wanting to read. Read a book, just sit down and read a book all day. Uh, I don't know, that's not too bad, right? Your brain's engaged when you're, when you're reading. You're learning something to some extent. Um, but yeah, that's been, it's been the way of things. But, uh, I don't know, Inktober, the weekly Inktober prompt last week was garden. And I was trying to figure out... You know, all the usual things came to mind, like, <clears throat> like I don't know, garden snakes and, um, I don't know, lots and lots of leaves and stuff. Uh, I don't know how I came up with this, but I guess I was Googling something. But Garden of the Gods in Sa uh, San Francisco, not San Francisco, uh, Colorado Springs, Colorado, completely different place. Um, came to, <laughs> came to mind. And, uh, so I just started Googling pictures of Garden of the Gods and I uh, found this one. I was like, you know, I think I can draw that. So I did. I went to work. And, uh, this is watercolor paper, obviously. And these are watercolors. Uh,. Yeah. I enjoyed this piece. It was, uh, I think my favorite part was drawing all these little trees. Um, I was working on getting some shadows and stuff on the rocks and pushing the hills further back, giving it some depth, uh, with darker greens. Um, I've had this puddle of green on, on my palette for a long time, and... I've just been steadily making my way through it and mixing it with other colors and especially when I'm doing stuff that uh, has like lots of trees and green stuff in it. That's my go-to green. Um, kind of proud of these mountains in the background. I just kind of like slathered or dabbed little blues on it. And uh, it turned out exactly as I wanted it to. Uh, hooray. 
<sighs> well, I'm sitting here, finally drinking my coffee and enjoying it. Um, I've been dealing with a bad-tempered printer for the last hour or so. Uh, cause I, need, I needed to print out a return label for something I ordered on Amazon. Uh, a pair of shorts. They were too big. So I'm returning them. And I just needed to print out this stupid label. And this printer just wanted to give me a hard time. So, uh, anyway. That's over and done with. And I'm enjoying my delicious coffee with a splash of milk in it. Uh, and looking out the window. It's supposed to rain at some point today. There's a tropical depression in the Gulf. And we really need it, man. It is hot and dry and our creeks are probably dried up. I wouldn't know because I haven't really been hiking uh, in a long time because I don't, I don't want to be around people, um, understandably. But anyway, we need rain, and I'm really excited. I'm excited about sitting inside and watching the rain come down through this tree in front of my window here. It's going to be a party. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, recently there was a comet, um, it was actually visible for like a week or so, uh, they called it Neowise, and, uh, apparently it's not gonna pass Earth until like 6,800 years from now, um, so it's a once in a lifetime comet. Uh, Rory and I tried to go out and see it, we drove up to Marble Falls. And, uh, the light pollution was just too much. So, I decided if I can't see it, I might as well draw it. Or at least my version of it. So here it is. Here's Neo Wise. He is a little ball of circles. He's a little... little circle of circles. Mm. Coloring him in with a jelly roll white pen. Which is my favorite white pen these days. Nothing really beats it. And then, uh, improvising the tail here on, on my canvas. I don't know what it is. Anytime something cool is happening in the night sky, there's either clouds or I don't know what I'm doing and I drive all the way somewhere where there's light pollution and it's just a, a disaster, but... Anyway, there's this drawing, there's this painting mixed media thing that I did, and I'm pretty proud of it. It's the first thing I've done in a while. 